just about 1 million expert European globalists rampaged in Barcelona on Sunday to indignantly dissent the Catalan autonomy choice. A huge number of elitists rioted waving standards saying I am Spanish, and Catalonia is Spain, and together we are more grounded, trying to oppose the will of the Catalonian individuals. Right.com reports. Police said around 350,000 individuals rampaged of the Spanish capital, however coordinators put the figure more like 930,000. The rally, intended to guard the solidarity of Spain, was sorted out by the Catalan Civil Society SCC, gathering, with the slogan Let's recoup our sounded judgment. Everybody has the privilege to state their conclusion. Until, today I had the feeling that, people, who were against autonomy couldn't talk. Today is an awesome day when everybody in Catalonia can talk, a French lady living in Barcelona told RT. At the point when gotten some information about the government police nearness in the district, the lady defended the measure saying that we can't overlook that Catalonia is still Spain. Wrapped in a Spanish banner, another neighborhood trusts Prime Minister Rajoy ought to take after the principles and exercise his powers. He is responsible for our administration, he should accomplish something. He should expel a few forces from autonomic government, since they are not following the guidelines. Others saw the Sunday assembling as an open door for the Catalans to go out to the boulevards and say we're Spanish too. You're not touching our Catalonia, since Catalonia is for everybody and Spain is for everybody. Individuals of peace that are here, we don't need war, we don't need struggle with Catalonia. This is our banner, and Catalonia's is our banner, the man says, wrapped in the red and yellow Spanish banner. Viva España! Viva Catalonia! The man got out, as the pack cheered and participated in his serenade. More than 2.2 million individuals crosswise over Catalonia cast their tickets in last Sunday's choice, which saw a 90% vote for a split from Spain. The police crackdown on the freedom submission in the wealthy Spanish area prompted more than 800 individuals being harmed in mass descents, with 700,000 individuals rioting of Barcelona to vent their outrage and voice bolster for the nearby experts. In the wake of the choice, Catalan territorial pioneer Carles Puigdemont vowed to show the outcomes to the neighborhood parliament, in spite of the Spanish constitutional court controlling the submission unlawful. The court had suspended the up-and-coming Monday session of the Catalan Parliament, amid which it was relied upon to address the result of the prominent vote. Spanish Prime Minister Mariano Rajoy stated, in an elite meeting with El Pais on Saturday, that Spain won't be partitioned and the country's solidarity will be kept up. We trust that we comprehend what the Spanish individuals are considering. What's more, they should realize that the administration additionally comprehends what it needs to do. The perfect would be not to need to take radical measures, but rather for that to occur there would need to be a few amendments. I might want the risk of a revelation of autonomy to be pulled back as fast as could be expected under the circumstances, he said. On Monday, the European Commission upheld the Spanish government's position that the submission was illegal and called the police crackdown an inward issue for Spain. This prompted allegations of fraud voiced against the EU with Serbian President Alexander Vucic saying, why that on account of Catalonia the choice on freedom isn't substantial, while on account of Kosovo, severance, from Serbia in 2008, is permitted even without the submission. The EU agreed with Spain's national government, and neglected to unequivocally censure the savage concealment of the vote. European Commission First Vice President Franz Timmermans depicted the twirly do charges and elastic shots utilized against voters and dissenters as a proportionate utilization of power that EU states are qualified for convey to ensure the law. It is an obligation for any legislature to maintain the lead of law, and this occasionally requires the proportionate utilization of force. Timmermans told the European Parliament in Strasbourg amid a civil argument on Catalonia 